Joanne Lee Lawrence cried and sobbed as she was sentenced to three years behind bars for causing the death of a cyclist. The 42-year-old struck Paola Ferroni with her Toyota RAV4 as she cycled along Kings Park Road in November 2014. She was rushed to hospital but died four days later. The court was told Lawrence talked and texted on her phone for nearly 40 minutes before the crash, with one message being sent to her just 16 seconds before she knocked Ms Ferroni off her bike. The defence claimed she was distracted by the roses on the medium strip, but the prosecution argued she was in fact completely oblivious to what was in front of her. The judge dismissed the story about the roses, saying it's an attempt by Lawrence to minimise her culpability. The court heard she made and received about a dozen calls and text messages during the journey from her home in Bullsbrook. The mother of two also suffers with long-term mental health problems and was in a highly emotional state at the time following a family argument. The judge said she should have known her psychiatric condition would have had an effect on her ability to drive. Dr Ferroni was a retired associate professor described as a celebrated academic who was dedicated to improving health care in developing nations. The judge said her death is a loss to society. Her partner of 34 years, Rosemary Coates, spoke briefly outside court. I think that uh, the, in the justice system, the victims have no voice whatsoever. It's all about uh, the rights of the offender. Lawrence will be eligible for parole after 18 months and has been disqualified from driving for three years. Danika DiGiorgio, Sky News, Perth.